is Susan Bush with SGTV. From time to time, I get to visit Angela Perko in her home studio in downtown Santa Barbara. Up the stone garden path, under the trellis weighted with morning glory, and past the family dog, is Angela's studio. Stacked high with canvases and drawings and packed with art books, old exhibition catalogs, and a single rocking chair, Angela Perko's studio seems incommensurately small for the sight of such vibrant production. It is a quiet place except for the brio of vivid color twisting and turning across one canvas to another. Angela, too, is quiet. She is gracious, polite, and very bright, but she is also quiet. Quietly, she has developed into one of the area's loudest voices in contemporary landscape painting. Her vividly colored abstractions of landscapes, still lifes, and figures remind me of Georgia O'Keeffe, Henrietta Shore, and Stanton MacDonald Wright, early modernists who helped define the trajectory of modern art from the American West almost a hundred years ago. Indeed, it's as if she has taken up their project, drawing from wells that she finds were abandoned long before they had run dry. Angela Perko's paintings inspire an imaginative new view of the landscape and life of Southern California. Instead of relying on the painterly style of the area's plein air artists to relay the rhythms of the natural world, Perko exploits Cubist, Orphist, and Art Nouveau ideas to bring movement into her paintings of the local scene. Her canvas is pulsed with an almost mystical sense of life's energies and rhythms. We are overjoyed to present to you Angela's fourth solo exhibition with the gallery. Make fine art part of your life. Angela Perko's new exhibition will be on view through November 27, 2011.